Hi, my name's Fred Turling. I'm the writer, director, and producer of the upcoming horror film, Croker. Now, Croker's a little bit of a different horror movie. It's a throwback, actually, to the 1970s drive-ins when we all got piled in the car with our parents and, and went out to whatever drive-in was nearby. But this one's really, really personal to me. And I know what you're thinking. Fred, how can it be personal to you unless you got monsters in your closet? Let me explain. What I did before I wrote this script is I went back home to Cannesburg, Pennsylvania, down along the creek, the railroad trestle, the railroad tracks, and I actually felt those memories come back to me. And I saw this story through the eyes of a child. Yes, it's a monster movie. However, the monster movie is actually frames the entire story itself. The movie's actually about two brothers, four friends, and this kind of time thing that happens with each and every one of us where we are away from somebody that we love or we know very, very well and we come in on some particular point in the timeline and accept automatically that there's going to be this connection that happens the same way that it was when we left off. But that's not necessarily true. And that's really the thing that gives the heartbeat to this story. One thing that I wanted to be really sure of in, in pre-production is that whenever the film is finished, and our street date is October 1st, and it doesn't end up on the shelf with all the other films in my 1,000 plus collection. So what I've done is I've gone ahead and I've secured some early distribution. Uh, we've signed through Distriber with Amazon.com, Amazon Direct Download, iTunes, and also Netflix. As we go through the process of production and post, we'll also be negotiating more distribution deals. So what I'm asking but, from you today is your help. Won't you please join Team Croker? We have a whole bunch of stuff to take care of yet, um, the, the creature, the costumes, transportation, things of that nature, and um, really appreciate it. Thank you for your time and attention. I'm sure that you're tired of hearing from me, so um, why not take a look at the teaser? Thanks. Maybe there's more to this than just an urban legend. You can't honestly believe this. 